Welcome back to the basement of the friendliest place on YouTube. We're in the hidden village in Twilight Princess HD, and we're gonna howl at the most challenging, apparently, howling stone ever. Yes, let's see how Ted does. <coughs> Former Land of Lakes choir boy and music aficionado. Oh, wow. Was it really long? Okay. <coughs> okay, that's not too bad. All right, go for it. Remain quiet. <coughs> Man, I've been coughing for like a month here in the basement. Okay, so we'll remain quiet while we let what, uh, dang Ted do his it. thing. Oh, man. Basement dwellers, quiet down. You're messing them up. Okay. What's the Nashville? Um, Is that 3-1? One, one? Oh. One, two, five. Wait, no. La, na, 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 na. Rado, rado. Two, one, two, one. Yeah. One... <laughs> nice! Well done. Take that that was the microphone. Awesome. We rocked that Casbah. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Wow, that was. Shh, man, gonna, you gotta chalk that up to being one of the best ever. I'm Let's gonna drop the microphone. You ready? Oh, that's a thousand dollars! Was okay. it really? Oh, P.S. Shout out to Cocktails and Consoles, a wonderful Let's Play channel that not only plays games, but teaches you how to make delicious drinks, whether adult-themed or uh, virgin drinks that are okay for your kids to drink. Yes. And, and she's a super nice lady, and we've collaborated with her before, and... She wrote a really nice comment the other day and said, What did she say? Your guys' audio quality. I'm still amazed. She's complimented it before. Oh, wow. I, she well, watched well, some you. video where we were on camera, and she was like, Is all that from just that one microphone there between you guys? It is. Yep. And I said, Yeah, well, it's a nice microphone. It's running through a box that has lights on it before it even gets to the computer. So here's the secret. And then ter Ted turns like 15 knobs to the left and 18 knobs to the right, but all to varying amounts, and then does a little hippie dance, and then... Uh, uh, no, there's no hippie dance. There's no. There's not There's not even one little hippie dance. Then he presses You're the bass boost button. Bass boost. Actually, I cut some of the bass off. Really? Um, yeah. Huh. So, uh, what are bass we doing? Bass boost. Uh, is this where the, the dog is next to the castle? Okay, cool. Good oh, to yeah, know. Oh, yeah, he's showing Thank us you. where, where to get right. our new thing. Let's move on. Let's get out of the <coughs> hidden village. There's nothing else to do here. Except there is one more very important, and without in fact, our dominion rod. non-optional thing to do. you got to turn into a real boy. Uh, by the way, though, when you're a boy, all, we'll do this on the way out, but I want you to do one thing as, uh, as man-link. Ew. Man-link? Man -link. <laughs> anyway, cocktails and consoles, um, we think you're great, and our audio commentary is just, uh, I don't know. I don't know how. I Oh, I told her maybe you'd tell her the secret. You know, what I should probably do sometime is do like a screen cap and do a let's edit audio. Yeah. For the basement. That'd be cool. Okay, uh, let's talk to Impas. Is that girl doing all right? I haven't uh, much to offer, but please make yourself comfortable here. Yes, the, the game is added. Whip out the Dominion Rod. The hey, game is that rod? Impasse until we talk to Impasse. Is that the Dominion Rod? It is. Oh, could it really be? I am. <laughs> I'm all out of prunes. Yes, it's a Dominion Rod. You should ask your doctor about that. The rod, 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 rod. I'm sorry, I'm afraid I'm not your nephew. <laughs> <laughs> this is the book. Please take it. Hey, remember when you had to get the book and link to the past? And you read that thing, and the turtle shells were all like... And you're like, oh man, this is awesome! I don't think I ever got that far in that game. That's so sad. Tech, this book can is we... written in the ancient languages. <laughs> <laughs> Prunes! Girl, meeting that girl must have been ordained by the gods so that I could be here today pass on this knowledge. Is she the old lady from um, the original Legend of Zelda? I think she's an, she's an homage. That tells you to go up, up, up the waterfall. Okay, we got the book. We can get out of here. Okay, what's the thing I'm supposed to do before <coughs> I leave? Well, before, before you quite leave, just stop and turn around and then go into like 
first person mode where the stick is just controlling your vision. And then you can walk forward. And look right. down. Well, you don't even need to walk. Just Okay. Just turn so, around, face the town, and look down at the ground. Okay. And then like, and then right, hold right. your head still for a moment. Right here? Yeah, and we'll be nice and quiet. Yeah. Okay, click. Okay, just wait, just wait. Just wait, just wait, wait for it. I'm waiting. Oh, sit, 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 oh, sit. Oh. <laughs> they oh, all just sit and look at you. Oh, they're so cute. And sometimes you can get like 11 of them to do it. It's, Let's do it. It's really funny. Come on. <laughs> Come on, kitties. Come on, kitten. Come on. Come well, on kitten. Welcome to episode 10 of The Hidden Village. <laughs> just, hey, this just is worth kidding. it. They all want to see it. Yeah, they all want to see this. You know happen. it's true. Cats on the internet are like number one YouTube bait. Okay, we're gonna do this. <clears throat> we're gonna do it right. Why have we never made a cat video? I, I, because I don't stay know. tuned to the basement for a cat video. Come Not on, kitty. Eventually. Kitty, 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 kitty. <laughs> this is so <laughs> funny being Link carrying a cat. And, <laughs> kitty, 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 kitty. He carries it so nicely. There's a and the cat is so content. There's a mask in Majora's Mask that allows you to play a song, and all the little animals in the village will follow you around and march. Oh, nice. Okay, don't go too far. You might get out of range of nice. half of them. Okay, now they're all gonna sit one by one. Ready? Wait for it. Oh, I and like the little calico sit. one on the left. Sit. He's he's my sit, favorite. Sit, sit, sit. <laughs> and they all blink and they all sort of shift their heads and. They're pointy little All right, dumb ears. That's it for. Uh, All right, we're out of there. <clears throat> okay, now the only man in Hyrule with the book smarts to read this ancient sky book is gonna be um, um. You're coming with me. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Shad. Please let me carry him all around Hyrule. I know, wouldn't that be great? Please. Did he just blink? Probably. Cats almost never blink. You ever watch a cat? It'll just stare at you. Well, yeah, because they can't move. They're ready to pounce and destroy you and attack you. You know that? Oh. Cat's gone. Harold. Okay. I let's, named him Harold. It's time to go to Shad. Oh. Um. In Renato's basement. In the basement. I love that there's a basement in this game. We should only play games that have a basement in them. That would include a lot of games. I think every Zelda dungeon you could consider a basement. It's true, we totally could. Every Mario underground level you could consider a basement. Okay. Are we warping? Uh, you sure could. You want to go to Renato's place, which is in Kakariko Village. So, okay. however you feel the best way to get there is. Elden Province. Uh-huh. Wait. Here you go. Yep. That's the one. Bam. Yes. That's where I want to go. That's where we gon' go. We gon' go where there is no snow. So, Kakariko. So Ted, the town get, I know. You getting excited for Breath of the Wild? <sighs> Speaking yes. of Legend of Zelda, which we're currently playing. You want to hear my theory about Breath of the Wild just by like watching gameplay footage and stuff? Yes. It may be completely true. Otherwise, it might be a completely like, useless uh, theory. I'm ready to hear it. I think it's the world after all the water drains from... Wind Waker. Wind Waker. Were you thinking the same thing? Well, I've heard that theory and I like it because Wind Waker is uh, my favorite 3D Zelda. Yeah. Wind Waker and the and original the, Legend of Zelda are my two favorite Zelda games. That's the Link Loses timeline. Zelda games. That's the Link Loses timeline, right? The, the hero uh, loses. I do not know the Hyrule Historia well enough to speak oh, to that off the okay. top of my head. I could access I know my, this is, this a is, different tab of my memory. If, if you this is like to. a sequel to Majora's Mask, then this is the this is like the the hero goes missing timeline. Mm. Uh, okay, let's talk to her. Well, it's unnecessary. We got to go downstairs and talk to the guy who's trying to solve all of the ancient writings. Now that we have the book, yeah, we got to go down to uh, the basement, the friendliest place on YouTube. Wait. Yeah, that's right. The basement is the friendliest. This is place the dirtiest on place in Hyrule, is what this place is. Well. I don't know. Telma's uh. bar. <laughs> <laughs> we are professional video game artists. Do not attempt to speak to Shad uh, without What's this? Oh. parental guidance. <laughs> this is such a Japanese reaction. They yeah. always do this. <gasps> or, oh. <laughs> yeah, think this about... This is riding a blazer. Look at this. Did not suppose could real word to break the seal. Think about that, right, though. The voice acting that. in this game is universal. I mean, Whoa, it's still to Japanese guy. sounding. Listen to this guy. Whoa, that was really... Spooky. Japanese is what I was going to say. Um, hey, did you catch... Oh, no reaction. This is not the statue. 
Thanks ever so. You brought me one step closer to solving the puzzle. I should give the book back. Now, I shall try out this word on other statues. I made the rounds of these statues so many times that I have memorized their locations. I'll raise marks on your map so you can find them. Come find me in case you have questions. Like my sock? <coughs> Remember every one of these marks is near an owl statue. Now, if you'll excuse me. Owl statues? Owl statues were a thing in Majora's Mask. Oh, keep an eye on your dominion, Rod. Uh-oh. He activated it, so now we can... <sighs> when imbued with life, the statues move in the same way as their master. We knew that already. We knew that already. Ready, ready. Duff man, knew that already. Oh, yeah. Can't uh, breathe. Oh, no. So, oh, no. <laughs> was there a statue, didn't he? Then we should go check out the spots, right? Well, not before I... Not after I do... Before I do this. So, he marked your map. Ah, I don't even need to do that. I keep forgetting. Like, you don't need to push any buttons. Eh. Yeah, what? Can't do it. So, this statue doesn't actually do it. Well, there... There's not a hole in the middle of that statue. Or, rather, it's covered up. Uh, oh, our, got it. Our next destination is the Bridge of Elden. Got it. Let's go there. Um, Shad did mark the owl statue locations on our map. And yeah. uh, that is a good first one to go to. Cool. Let's go to the Bridge of Elden. I was going to say, though, about um, voice acting that, uh, you know, The Legend of Zelda's really never had much voice acting other than, like, languageless stuff. You know, like, oh, oh, <laughs> why we call hey! Link grunty in this game? Because he grunts <laughs> in a universal human language of, of effort. Of grunts. <laughs> hey! But Breath of the Wild has voice acting in it, which, like, how many different actors in different Hi! languages did they have to hire? And how many translations did they have to? Well, not really very many. If you think about it, that guy was just speaking Japanese words. Not in Breath and then, of the Wild. Hey! Oh, yeah, Breath of the Wild. Yeah, there is. Oh, you're right. I see what you're saying now. Okay, what are we doing here? Looking for an owl statue. Yes. Looking for an owl statue. If um, I remember, it's on the bridge. It is to the, left. the little red flag on your map. So I think it might be on the other side of the bridge. <laughs> now that I am stuck down here. Oh, oh, ow. Mm. Whoa! Get out of here. This is hero mode. Yeah, really. You're in uh I'm on fire. You're in a tight spot. This dog is on fire. This dog is on fire. Whoa. Whoa. There it is. What? You see? Oh, hello. It's on a director. But I would like to know how many uh, basement dwellers, if anyone out there has the power of Google or an immense catalog of nerdy knowledge, um... Please let me know. Let us know if you know how many different languages uh, the Breath of the Wild voice acting requires. I'm guessing, I mean, I've heard the trailer in Japanese and in English, and maybe they just have like their three or four or five biggest markets. So you just gotta move acting, this guy off of this thing? Is that and, it? and then the rest of it, yeah. What? And then you get what? a letter to what? write in your book, and then once you've completed Ooh. the word, you go back to that first owl statue in the basement. And you say the different word. Oh, yeah. one sky character. <laughs> I'm Flappy. I'm a sky character. Missing ancient book. But there's still other missing characters. Collect all five. All right. So now if you check out your map, you got more red flags there. What a pull. Uh, you could go to, let's see. A large red dot on the north end of the area indicates the presence of another owl statue in Kakariko Gorge. Move uh, it aside, step okay. in the circle beneath, get the next... Missing piece of the ancient Large red dot in a Kakariko Gorge. Large red dot in a Kakariko Gorge. Kakariko Gorge. A guy named George. Does gorge rhyme with anything other than George? Uh, forge? Nope. Yes. Wait. Forage? No, forge. Like, uh, a, like a, like a, a forge where you make, forge a weapon. Have you driven a forge lately? Built forge tough. Don't eat your salad with a spoon, eat it with a forge. forge. A salad forge. Forge score and seven years ago. <laughs> uh uh. Do you want to uh do you want to ferry across or forge the river? <laughs> um okay, Kakariko Gorge. Where do we where do we get? Is that that red dot? A large red dot or a it's red dot. Right flag. where we were. It's right where we were. Well that's right? where you entered the area, I think. Oh, yeah, the red flag. North of the area indicates the presence of another owl statue. Indicates the presence. Ba, da, Ooh, presence. Ba, I love presence. Ba, ba, ba. 
Hey, man, it's getting close to time to finish up this episode. Oh, man, we're only you know one what? statue in. I think you're right. Maybe we could find the next one. And uh, let's see here. Oh, uh, that's the wrong way. Or wait, maybe that's the right way. Keep going that I think way. This is the correct. Correct. Way. Good use of the word correct. I I say right and wrong. Oh, I, mean correct and I found it. <clears throat> All right. Next time in the basement dweller dwellers. And next yeah. time in the basement basement dwellers, we're gonna move that statue and get that letter. And uh, until next time, basement we, dwellers, we yep, think that well, you are more uh, nighttime uh, bird like than. Um, a dark chocolate pie shaped like a crow in, in the, the basement. basement. <laughs>